Greetings, viewers. I know it's been a while since I posted anything, but uh, I'm here to give you a short tour of the City College Ceramic Studio. So, here it is. This is the main room when you come in from outside. There are shelves for students' work. There's lots of table space. Over here is the we are the wheels. This is the only kick wheel. The rest are electric wheels. They're pretty old, but it's cool. There's lots of natural lighting in here. Very high ceilings. These are more shelves for students' work. Sink. Over here we have our plaster studio. And here is where you make all your plaster. You know, no plaster goes in the sink because uh, plaster clogs drains and stuff. But uh, this is where we do our casting and mold making. Bam. And uh, this is the um, head of the department's office. Okay, this room is the clay recycling room. This is where the most of my work is, is happening. Uh, this is dried out clay. Reclaim, 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 reclaim. Um, Apparently, clay hasn't been recycled for a while here, so I just started yesterday. We recycled about 200 pounds of clay. Uh, it's very easy. All you got to do is dig your hands in the mud. Take said mud. Put it on plaster, but of course nicely. And then let it set up there. After uh, plaster soaks, kind of sucks the water out of clay. After that, you can flip the clay over make like a big patty and then wedge it. This is the um, the pug mill. It works, but it's, you know. But I'm doing it the old fashioned way right now because there's, as you can see, it's, it thinks it hasn't really been maintained that well, but anyway. So this is really fun. I'm in here a lot. Um, I love it. Uh, if we come out here back into the room and make a right. This room is where the kilns are kept. Boom. Um, there used to be a lot of old kilns in here, gas kilns that weren't in use. They've since been deconstructed. Uh, and now we have three kilns. We have this huge kiln which you have to lower with a chain. They're all electric. This medium sized kiln and this little kiln, which usually we fire extremely low fire glazes like reds. Um, this is where fired work is. This is glazed where everything here is bisque. Everything here is terracotta. I work in white clay here but I have to be very strict in keeping it separated because everything here is iron everywhere is iron in the air there's iron on the floor it's everywhere here's a storage room I also think that Mary uses this as her studio uh, there's some cool stuff in here check this out this is really really cool um, in the next room it's like a labyrinth here right this is the glaze room Here's the tables with the um, the large bottles of commercial glazes. There's a casting slip down here, eye wash station, another sink. And here are some, you know, my goal is to actually redo a lot of these test tiles so that they're relevant to what we actually have here. We have a lot of commercial, um, Duncan commercial glazes and under glazes. Here they are. These are all glazes, glazes, glazes. And down here are the under glazes. Um, and down here there's uh, larger things. And if you're interested in glaze chemistry, we have all the chemicals that you need to, com to make your own, to formulate your own clay bodies and your own glazes. Got ball clay here. Where's the kaolin at? Gerson borate, feldspar. Yeah. Talc. It was fun. Um, 
There's also some colorants over here. Da -da -da. This granular root tail somewhere. Yeah, so and if you leave out of this door, you're back into the main room. So that's it. That's the City College Ceramic Studio. I hope you had fun.